This video guide will walk you through an airboard checklist. You can start by inspecting the solar panels. You have to make sure that there are no cracks or damages on the solar panels. Your next step is to raise the mass fully. Make sure it goes up all the way and if there are any pauses or troubles raising the mast, grease if necessary. On to the wiring harness. Inspect the wiring harness to check if there are any cracks in one of the ends or abrasions in the full wire. On to the batteries. Check the batteries. This aeroboard has SLA batteries. You do not need to fill or load test these. However, regardless of any trailer, always check the batteries. Make sure they are not corroded and in good working condition. Now you can do a walk around of the unit, checking the frame and seeing if there are any bends or dings in the frame. Any damages should be reported to your fleet manager. Bends and damages to the frame can give you problems while towing the unit down the road. Next, you can inspect the taillights and the fenders. As seen on this unit, this fender is bent and damaged, however, it does protect the wheel very well. Check the lights and see if there are any cracks in them. If there are, report this and try to fix it. And on to the jacks. Inspect the jacks, see if they go up and down properly and lock into place. Don't forget to inspect the tongue. Make sure it is straight. Inspect the controller box. See if there are any broken or missing pieces. While you are in the controller box, you can test all the light functions. Go slowly, one by one, and have someone spectate the arrow board from afar. This is when you can know if there are any out or broken lamps. And finally, inspect the lamp hoods. These should not be damaged. Any damages should be replaced. 